So within the school setup, if you want to create your own activities, you can do that. And everything can be personalized to the individual or the individual class, and you can create as many activities as you like. Here's how to do it. When you're on your timeline, you can go to this button here, plus activity, and then the plus new creates a new activity. And you can go to an individual activity or a grouped activity. A grouped activity is where you might want to break something down into individual parts. So if it's a science lesson, it might be all the individual parts within that. You might have a demonstration and then people need to read something in the books Then they need to get the Bunsen burners, etc, etc. So you can build sub parts within a routine and that's the activity group or you can just add an individual activity. We'll look at that one. So you click on that and you can choose one of the images from the library that's there, or you can upload something from your own computer. So let's look at that. Click on the upload button, and we'll choose that one there, and we'll go upload that image. And that's the image there where we're gonna use. And you can zoom that in or out, however you want it to be. So let's say that's, that's the way you want it. You can drag it and move it. And so let's say this is gonna be ICT, and then you can add that to the timeline. That image will now be available for you to use for future times. So once you've created it once, it's always there in your, in your image library. It always adds at the end of the day. So then we'll move it to wherever we need to be in the individual day. So let's say it needs to be there. We'll just drag it there and put it there.